Hey everybody, it's Trevor Bryan, author of The Art of Comprehension. I just wanted to share a few thoughts about uh, Lemonade Club by Patricia Polacco, one of my favorite books, um, and how you can use it to help kids to think about mood structure. Um, from the very beginning of the story, right, Patricia Polacco sets up a positive, happy mood, right? Characters are close together, we can tell by their facial expressions, right? And she does this over the course of a few pages, right? Showing the joy and happiness uh, and the closeness of the characters uh, in the beginning. And as we know, uh, stories are told through mood and they have mood structures, so that mood is gonna change. And sure enough, right? As we go on, we get a slightly different mood. Until we're here, right? And the story really kind of takes off and begins. Um, what we want to think about then is, right, the mood's pretty obvious through the pictures, but we don't know exactly what's causing the mood. And so that's where the text comes in. The text uh, explains um, what's causing the mood and right, the ingredients that we need to know in order to comprehend a story is uh, the events that are taking place, right, how characters are responding to those events and um, what the uh, um, what the reason for those uh, reactions are, right? That's one way to think about stories and another way to think about it is just simply what's the mood, um, how do you know what the mood is and what's causing the mood um, or what we want our readers to be able to, to answer and track. Um, and this is a great book, like all of her books. Um, the Lemonade Club, uh, Patricia Blocko does a great job um, and provides uh, really wonderful stories uh, that are rich in meaning, but they're also really great for students to use uh, the art of comprehension to explore, think about, and discuss these books. All right, hopefully it helps. Have a great day.